Okay, so we are back on my code pen with a different quote, but this time we are on the console tab of developer tools. Now, I'm not, I don't have any examples to show you right now of console. I'm not going to spend a ton of time on console either um, because it's pretty similar to how your console runs on your computer, which I've talked about in other videos. It's a good way to get administrative messages. It also has some alerts you can build into your code. Console log in your JavaScript will put it in this Chrome console. There is something really cool that you can do whenever there is information in the console. It's um, dot .table, console.table. Now there's not anything in here right now, but it, if there was any data in there, it sorts it out, makes it really easy to look at. That's something that I really do like about console. So since this is loading all of my zip lines on CodePen, all of these little zip lines had console logging messages. And since they're all being loaded in their own little windows, all of those messages are loading right now. So if we look at this one, that's my location and the response for this object. It's, it's all that information. It's in the console, which is a really awesome tool. I especially like it when I'm getting information from an API. I want to view everything in that API so I can figure out what key I need to reference later. There are about a hundred gazillion ways to use the console effectively. And just like everything else, you'll have to figure out what works best for you and what you use the most. I want to stress one more time to check out Chrome DevTools. Let's find the console panel. This is what the page looks like for the documentation. It is so easy to use. Check it out.